um Raila Amolo Odinga today stormed Mombasa County and uh you know this after William Samiruto harshed in 2023 while in Mombasa now Raila of course went there to water down the gains that Ruto made you know or had in Mombasa and folks feel gone let me take this time by saying hi to you I believe you're doing well whatever you are now if you like politics then this take take a time of course subscribe because we'll be meeting here every time now let's come back to the big question and this big question is what did Rela Modinga what was Raila looking for in Mombasa? Now, the reception was, of course, massive. As we know that Raila Moldinga is, as in Mombasa, is his bedrock. No one can take Mombasa from him. Now, we saw Mombasa governor there. Uh, we saw some coastal leaders you know, receiving him. Now, the message that, of course, Raila Moldinga um, conveyed to Kenya Kwanza people is that uh, he will soon tell Kenyans his next move you will tell kenyans that what he's planning to do and he's saying that his, his next move or next statement will not go well with ruto now um the question is what is this thing that Allah Mudinga has been telling us that he wants to you know to show kenyans we we'll say 23 with a different a different year in kenya and he will tell kenyans his next political move of course right now a lot is happening. Like we are seeing Kanzo Msioka demanding support from Raila Odinga. Yeah, Kanzo is saying that he has supported Raila Odinga more than three times. So it is his turn now. Okay, and Raila Odinga needs to extend his hand and of course support Kanzo Msioka. Now, um, ODM leaders, of course, uh, said not this, and they say that Raila cannot be intimidated by anyone. The question is, is Raila's next move? Will he tell us or will he tell his supporters that Kalonzo is the next king or the next leader of Azimio or the next um, flag bearer? That's the question I think asking ourselves because right now we don't know what's really happening in Kenya. So people are waiting of course to, to, to feel what I will say and people of course will talk. Now the question I think I pose to you my viewer, do you think Lana Moldinga will front Kalonzo Msioka? Or do you think you will tell Kenyans that he is still there in the race? Do you think so? Do you think you tell Kenyans that he is in the race? Or do you think he will tell Kenyans that now Kalonzo Msioka is the next flag bearer? Of course, um, Kenya Kwanza people will be very happy if Raila Moldinga says that Kalonzo is the next flag bearer. Because they know Kalonzo Msioka is a walkover. <laughs> yeah, it's true. Ruto knows that Kalonzo cannot, cannot you know, shake him. It's a walkover. But of course, uh, remember in 202, Rela Moldinga did not vie, but he said Kibaki Tosha. And of course, Moi laughed, but what happened? Kibaki managed to sweep the whole Kano and he defeated Uru Kenyatta. So if Rela Moldinga says Kalonzo, of course, uh, uh, it is still the. Because all, all supporters of Rela Moldinga will vote for Kalonzo Msioka. That's the reality. So not, not, nothing much will, have still, will, will change because. Raila's voice is what, is what matters. Now, those, that's what happened in Mombasa. He said that he will tell Kenyans his next move. And of course, we are still waiting for that next move because he's been saying it ever since. Like, it's, it's now one month, okay? So, of course, I, I believe he's still finding the best time to, of course, announce to Kenyans what he will tell or what he will make um, this year. Now, folks, I, I, I still ask you, uh, like, Tell us, do you think Raila will front Kalonzo Msioka? What is this bombshell that Raila has been announcing every time? What is this bombshell? Okay? Today has announced it in Mombasa. Tell me, I would like to hear it from you. Of course, subscribe there. Let's always meet here whenever. We have some amazing content. Thank you for watching and see you soon in the next video. Thank you.